Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Just recently, I fully maxed out my Jump Trooper reinforcement. Not just the three cards that I use for the Jump Trooper, but every single card available. I'll have some max level, level 20 Jump Trooper gameplay highlights in the background. I'll also be talking about different star cards and what are my personal favorite for you to use. Now for the aerial class as a whole, there are five different star cards that you can use but you can only activate three of them at a time. Out of the five cards, I'd have to say four of them are really, really good. And the fifth one is kind of odd, I must say. Anyways, I'll move over to which cards I use the most. The first card is the Battle Hardened card. What this card does is it adds extra health to your Jump Trooper's base health bar. This star card is pretty useful if either you're an aggressive Jump Trooper or if you're constantly running from enemies. The extra health that this star card gives you could just save your life. The next two cards are quite similar, the improved jetpack and the improved rocket launcher. These two star cards reduce the recharge time for the two different abilities, the improved rocket launcher and the improved jetpack. These two in my opinion are essential. I don't know about you, but I will gladly take a jetpack that can be used with a 10 second less cooldown. For me personally, I always have these two star cards active on my Jump Trooper, and I interchange between Battle Hardened and the Aerial Training card. The Aerial Training card is kind of like the survivalist trait from the first game. What this does is on every elimination, it returns 50 health back to you if you have it maxed out. If you're an aggressive Jump Trooper, this is definitely the card for you. And if you know me, I'm an aggressive player. And the final card that is available for the aerial class is the survivalist card. This star card is quite interesting I must say, but I'll give my opinion after I tell you what it actually does. The survivalist card increases your regen rate once you've started regenerating health. At max level, you can regain 100 health per second. Like I said before, this is an interesting card. It only actually works when your health starts regenerating. If you keep getting shot at and never get the chance to regenerate health, then this card will be rendered useless. The survivalist star card is an interesting choice. Personally, I think they should have made a card that makes the health regen start faster. In my opinion, that would be a valuable card. Now I'll let the rest of the Jump Trooper highlights play in the background, but I have one question for you guys. What is your favorite type of Jump Trooper? The First Order variant, the Clone Trooper variant, or any other variant? Let me know in the comments. I'm Infinite Potatoes, and I'll see you on the battlefront. MTT is crossing checkpoint three. They are approximately two thirds through their journey.
surviving squads and make ready for phase three. The enemy cruiser is preparing to launch. Destroy it by detonating the front and rear fuel pipes. We will destroy the ship. Thank <laughs> you.